In this course, we'll be using a program called PSIM to do basic simulations of power electronics. So, there's a free version that anybody can download. The only limitation is it has to be used on Windows. So if you have a Windows computer, you can go to this website, just type in PSIM, um, or go to this website here, URL, and you can click on Download Demo. It'll give you a demo version. I don't believe it has an ex expiration date. It just has limited functionality, but adequate functionality that you should need for this class. So once you get to this page, you can try to download one. But in order to do that, you need to create a login. So if you don't have an account yet, you would go to this button and fill out all this stuff and register. Then you would log in, and I've already logged in, so here you can log in. It goes to your uh, profile automatically. All you really need to do is click this again. It'll bring you back to the download page, and then you can click download now, and it'll start your download for you. Then once you have it downloaded, you open up the zip file, and which is here, you open up this file and run it and it will install the version of the latest version of PSIM that you can use for this course. Once you open PSIM, you get this type of interface. You usually get this tip of the day, which you can close, and you'll be able to make a circuit and simulate it in this environment, this PSIM environment, and we'll be able to look at the output waveforms. So for now, that's the step for just downloading the program, which we'll be using in this course.